I'm here with Pete Jolly Spencer, who just won third place in Grandma's Greatest Cookie Contest. Um, tell me about the cookie you made. Okay, I made a Ritz cracker cookie. Very simple and easy. Five ingredients, Ritz crackers, something salty, Hershey Kisses, something chocolate, and then something sweet, brown sugar, nuts, and butter. And it's a very kid-friendly recipe. That there's lots of steps in the recipe that the kids can help with. And I like doing things that taste good, have a good result, but that are very simple to do. Uh, I'm here with Ann Whitley, who just won second place in Grandma's Greatest Cookie Contest with her pecan dream bars. Um, tell me a little bit about your cookie. Well, I like the crunch on the bottom, and then the good stuff in the middle, and the crunchy on the top. And I just think it's just a good variety, you know, all in one. Yeah. And you were talking about your secret ingredient. Tell me a little bit about that. The, the toffee bits, the toffee chips, yes. I tweaked the recipe and, and added those, and it just made it have a much better flavor. I'm here with Steve Jockinen, who just won first place in Grandma's Greatest Cookie Contest. And Steve is actually a grandpa. Steve, tell me a little bit about your recipe. I received the recipe from my wife uh, four or five years ago, and I uh, was fascinated by the um, technique that it took to make the cookie. You have to make the dough, and then at that point, put it in the refrigerator for 36 hours, uh, is a minimum of 24, but 36 hours is preferable, and that allows the uh, all the liquids, which are, would be the eggs and, and the vanilla and then the butter, to incorporate into the dough, and that's part of the secret. The other part is to have um, some sea salt in the dough itself, and then sea salt sprinkled on top of the cookie before it's baked. And it's flavored with cranberries and... White chocolate. I use uh, nothing but the best, either Valjarona or Calabo. This happened to be Calabo in this recipe, and... And uh, the cranberries are, are just normal dried cranberries, but the best you can find. Uh, uh, Home Depot, not Home Depot, but I'm sorry. Um, you would get them in Trader Joe's or you'd get them in Fresh Market, and um, it's good stuff.